Okay, and we're back. Uh, now for the infantry part of it. Uh, remember what I was talking about before about the pillboxes? Well, this time that'll uh, pretty much uh, slaughter you. They're like a machine gun nest, pretty much, only with roids. Uh, you can take out the guy that's inside the uh, bunkers, though, but it takes a little bit of, tr bit of a trick to do it. Uh, it took me two tries, but... Uh, I didn't really see it important to uh, kind of air it. Uh, basically, I took out those two uh, and I edited it out. Uh, I figured you guys didn't want to know. My first attempt at dying, and I figured you'd want to see a successful run. Uh, and here's 3DO's fail again because there's no manual aim. And I'll get to that in a second. You've seen those boxes. The auto aim is very good for here, but now we turn around. By the way, that bunker is still shooting at us, so if we step too far back. Anyway, you see these guns back there? And you see these guns up here? Well, pretty much, uh, you have to position yourself just right to where you can shoot it, but yet not get blown up. And there's a minesweeper. That's not a good sign. But at least uh, our man's job is done. We'll use his minesweeper later. Let's go ahead and move uh, Boomer up. And like I said, I did edit out where I died once. So there's like one little skip there, but nothing too bad. See, so then you got this box here with machine gun in it. And then you got this box here which is a uh, grenade in it which is kind of a pain in the butt to get to see basically this is how much trouble I have to get to to get these boxes I have to uh, go, go down like this and I have to roll over and kill it say it like this Boom. Uh, again 3DO uh, no idea why they took out the manual aim, but okay. Anyway, now like I said, here's where I died once, and I re-put in Boomer into position. Armand still got his minesweeper. And Boomer has semi-auto, I mean a fully auto and then a grenade. So let's go ahead and start taking out these pillboxes. As long as you use these boxes, uh, these bricks here, or some cover, and do a lot of rolling, you're fine. Uh, if you played Final Front, the training level, uh, pretty much is the same premise here. You just roll around and you manually shoot into the position. It'll auto aim for you to take it out. Nothing too hard, but a little bit painful. Now you see there's that guy up there. You notice that Armand is still getting shot at by the machine gun nest. So let's go ahead and take out this guy in the corner without getting our butt blown off. Have to be careful here because uh, if you go out this corner here, there's there's minefield. If you go out to the metal section, there's minefield. And if you stick too close beyond these boxes here, there's minefield. So that's about as far safe as you can go without getting into a minefield. Now I have to take out this bunker here. Actually, three bunkers, my bad. And you notice they all cover themselves pretty well. So just take one out. It'll auto-aim for you, and then just back off. Same thing, same thing, same thing. Nothing too hard here. Now we just go ahead and make sure that he's set in a safe position. Make sure everything's cleared out for the next step, or this thing is not going to end well. Now we got ourselves our minesweeper. Yes, uh, this is like I think the second time we use this in the whole World of War series. Kind of sad, isn't it? 
considering Sergeant's Heroes loves to use the minefields and the minesweeper. But, anyway. Eventually, oh, there we go. We ran into our first mine. And there's our second mine. If you don't have this minesweeper, they have a extended AoE. So, uh, if you have your minesweeper out like this, it actually nerfs the mine for you. So, you can walk walk by safely. So if you're thinking, oh well I can just run across blindly and like no, you have to actually defuse the defuse the mines by finding them. I mean not I mean weaken the mines, not defuse them, my bad. There's another mine. Let's go ahead and make sure is it oh there's one last mine. Okay. We found four mines along the trail, so we should be safe now. Go ahead and use Boomer and drop off the end here, and he's safe. And put him on the bridge. Now, considering this is 3DO and 3DO logic, that means that either A, there will be a random ambush, or B, that they mine the bridge. So, let's go ahead and use our mod here and just go ahead and make our way through the end. And pretty much, I'm calling this a video here. Uh, this isn't too long of a level part, it's just being safer safe and sorry just using the minesweeper throughout this so you can go ahead and consider this the end of the video so uh... later guys and go ahead and enjoy the rest of the minesweeper footage uh... later